Hello there, welcome back. One from my Northern Monk subscription box from December 22. And this is one of their old flax store series, OFS. This is 096, and the theme this December was Ireland. And because of the, a complaint they had, they changed the labels. So this is the changed label. I'll put the, the original label in. I just hope they don't sue me for that. So this is a bit of a corker. So it's a barrel aged imperial stout, aged in Irish whiskey bars. The ABV, 15%. <laughs> I don't think I've ever had a beer that high. 15%. <laughs> so I really look forward to this. I think this might be the only beer I'll be drinking today. So I do love my stouts. It's a 330 milk can. Maybe that's a good idea for <laughs> rather than being a big 440 or 500 mil. IBU's 25. EBC 40, that's the colour, so it's black, they're saying. The original gra gravity for the, the the brewers out there is 1.105. Brew date 9th of March 2022, best before 12th of December 2023. Although I think it would last uh, a lot longer than that, eh? Let's crack it open and see how it pours into my stout glass. I could smell that on the pour. It was really dark on the floor and quite viscous. You ever had a chocolate liqueur? Chocolate and whiskey. That was the, the smell. So, we'll have a wee look. Don't they opaque. Not much ahead to speak of there. You didn't expect that at 15%, did you? Let's have a wee look. Not much light getting through. I'll put it on the highest setting. See if anything gets through. It's, it's almost black. It's very, very, very deep brown. You can't get a, a jet black beer, I don't think. I've never seen one. There's always a hint of colour. Uh, let's have a wee sniff at it. That is sticking to the glass. A wee bit. You get in the bottle, you get in the whiskey. There's a wee bit of fruitiness there as well, which I didn't expect. But it smells boozy. You know what it smells like? A bit like a port or a sherry or something. But I mean, that's the cask you're getting the whiskey. It's, but it's, it's mellowed right down. It's not, it's not like a, you would get like a, a strong whiskey smell, obviously not, but a very mellow, it's beautiful. There's lots of other things going on there, that's beyond my powers of description. But there is a hint of chocolate there as well, a cocoa weed, you know. Cheers, my dears. I'm only going to have two sips for now. There's so much going on there. It's absolutely divine. I'm getting a lot of cocoa, chocolate. I'm getting the whiskey. 
I'm getting the barrel. I'm getting the wood. I'm getting a bit of sweetness. Like a fruity sweetness. I'm getting a bit of coffee there as well. But the cocoa is like a very rich chocolate, you know. 90% or something. Maybe not your size. There's not a great deal of bitterness. There's no, there's not a great deal of like roasty bitterness that you would you'd expect. It's very mellow and smooth. It's not as full bodied as I thought it would be. It's medium bodied. It's no, it's no watery or thin or by any means. There is. I don't know if it's because I've been eating salt and vinegar crisps like this afternoon, but it's as is it. There's a quite drying finish in it. That could just be my palate's ruined with salt and vinegar crisps. But... <sighs> it's very smooth. You know, I, I can. I'm sure I can taste cherries in there as well. I think there's cherries mentioned in it. I'll tell you what we'll do. Let's have a look at the at the uh, scribe magazine you get with the patrons subscription box. So this is OFS Old Flax Store Project 096 Ireland Barley's Imperial Stout 15%. <laughs> a big rich complex imperial stout aged in Irish whiskey barrels and loaded with roasted and chocolate flavours you are getting the roasty malts but you're not getting the bitterness that you sometimes accompanies that this is absolutely delicious I, th I was expecting it to be a bit more Full bodied, but I mean, that doesn't detract from it. It's a smooth, lovely, smooth drink. The booziness you can't taste the 15%, you can smell it, but I'm not, I don't need burn or anything or heat in my chest, or you know, that's this. This is absolutely delicious. I wonder if there's anything on their website. Let's have a look at that. Yeah, I can't find anything on their website. There's no cached version or anything. It's as if it's been uh, deleted from existence. Let's see if we can... Uh, there might be something on other websites. There's nothing on Northern Monk. Indie beer. It's £8.10 a can on... This is Indie beer though. UK, but there's nothing, there's no extra information uh, apart from anything different to that. So, do you think they've tried to scrub all the information about it? <laughs> really being sued or something? Anyway, this is an absolute beautiful beer. Try it if you can find it. Well, this, is it still in stock? Yeah, still in stock. £8.10. What's a bottle of wine? Good wine. Round about that, you get a very good wine for that. And that's about 15%. So, I'd rather have this than a bottle of wine. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time, hopefully. Ta ta for now. Cheers, my dears. so nice.